flipped me the bird And then it was gone Some beach Somewhere Cause I'm on top of the world bacon. We got five eggs over here. We're gonna boil. And some toast. Nothing too crazy. grams of fat, 240 calories, so three is good enough. She said, I don't think I'm ready. I hope you understand. We're going to time these eggs for about, I don't know, 20 minutes. Uh, so far, it's been maybe two minutes, two or three minutes, so 17 more minutes to go. I like normally never have boiled eggs, but I'm trying to bulk. I'm trying to uh, just, you know, put on as much weight as I possibly can for the next month or two. And I normally have scrambled eggs, but I'm switching it up. I'm going to start having boiled eggs as much as I can and as often as I can. I weighed myself this morning, but our scale is trash. Like, I couldn't get a proper reading. I stepped on it. It said I weighed 208. And then it just started dropping to 200, 190, 180, 187. Started climbing back up again. So I need to scale. I have no idea how much I weigh. I'm just trying to put as much food in me as I possibly can. And when I do buy a scale, I'll find out then, I guess. It's January now. It's January 3rd. So by the time maybe March or April comes, I'll start cutting. Probably March because it'll take a lot longer for me to cut and I've never done this before. I've never, I've tried to cut and I've attempted it a couple of times and I failed miserably so um, hopefully I try for the last time. I'm kind of keeping track of what I eat. I'm not really weighing anything. I'm just kind of eyeballing it. So if I have three slices of bacon, I'm just going to slap that into the fitness app and see what that tells me. You know, five boiled eggs, whatever. The, the app tells me I'm just gonna do it that way because it's just too much work to be. When I start cutting, I'll, I'll worry more about weighing everything. Right now, it's just I'm just gonna eyeball it the best I can, and hopefully, I'll be eating enough. I think I will be. I want to put on at least 10 pounds. Shouldn't be too hard. 10, 15 pounds. I love to eat, so. And I don't wanna go steady. I just wanna be your friend. What we had is over, there's no reason to pretend That any of this was going somewhere, I guess this is the end My heart starts to slow down to where I can't even This is the part I'm dreading the most My eyes start to tear up to where I can't even see if you change your mind, girl, I'll be waiting. I cannot fight this misery I'm hating. Cause without you here, I'm suffocating. Holding my breath till you're back here. So 
story Forgive me if you can I don't like how this turned out And I hate the way I am You can do much better It was so easy to see That we don't belong together This was just not meant to be My brain starts to slow down My head's spinning rapidly My legs start to give out And I fall to my knees If you change your mind Girl, I'll be waiting I cannot fight this misery I'm hating Cause without you here I'm suffocating Holding my breath till you're back here I'll let you go, but I don't I'm done eating. I got a little cleaned up. Just heating up my car now, and I will be off to the gym. Bottoms up. Okay, so uh, for a decline, I'm going to go for four sets of 12. For incline, I'm going to do four sets of 12. For flat bench, I'm going to try for uh, four sets of six with 175. And do some cable flies, my upper, upper chest, lower chest, and I'm just going to do some simple tricep workouts and go from there, I guess. So last week I tried the uh, tried a 35 on incline for sets of eight. So this week I'm trying sets of 12 with a 25 on. And I'm having trouble. I got three sets in so far. I'm getting it, but by the last one or two reps, I'm really pushing to get it on there. It's almost like just falling right on me. It's like a little step back. It's a little depressing. So I got one more set of that, and then I'm gonna move on to. Flat bench. Alright, if, if I'm gonna fail on a set, it's gonna be now. So, maybe I won't. Oh, uh, yeah, look at that. Look at all that weight. That is just incredible. If I get this, I'll get sponsored for sure. They say like get up, like curl yeah. up, like put it away. Like. <laughs> Somebody help me. Cut the video. Cut the video. Cut the video. <laughs> I'm gonna need a spot. Would you be able to spot me? I shouldn't need a spot, but <laughs> just looking. <laughs> I was supposed to do. I was supposed to do 175 first, but the, the bench was in like use, so I did decline, incline. Now I gotta do the bench.
take into consideration you did other angles on the bench press already. Like you're, you got to think of this is like your last one of your last workouts. So yeah. something you did at the start, you're not going to be able to do it yet. Yeah, exactly. that's why I do chest. I switch up what I start with. I was really hoping to do this first. No, fresh. I wait two minutes if I were you, you're still not going to get that. Yeah, I'll wait two minutes. Yeah, you struggle, you know. Wait or something. Yeah. Alright. Jesus. Oh. Yeah, why these big weights? Pretend I'm not even here, just talking about shit. I gotta make it look like I have friends at the gym. <laughs> In actuality, these are my family, they have to like me. I actually spent two hours pretty well just doing chest. And I only did three workouts. Uh, did some incline, some decline, and some flat bench. The only thing is, the Decline and incline took away from my actual flat bench strength. I guess it just kind of tired me all out. So I was only able to do like 95 pounds on bench for sets of six, which ain't a lot at all. But what can you do? I'm just cooking some food here. And you know what? I think my brother is right. He mentioned to me yesterday that uh, when people include their whole meals into their whole entire day, they, they tend to eat a lot more. I'm just trying to bulk and I'm just working with what we got. So what I have on the go here is some steak. I, I haven't measured anything. That's a cup of rice here, ready to go. Got some vegetables here, just some bell peppers cut up. And I got two chicken burgers down there that are just about ready. So I guess I'll show you that when it's all done and hopefully I can eat it all. Doing 10 things at once. So, I got my rice all ready to go. Uh, so I have my peppers in here. See, I don't even like rice on a good day. White rice, I used to hate it. Like, I, I basically forced myself to like white rice. And I find it tastes a lot better when you add a little flavor to it. So, what I did was I cut up my steak. I know it looked a lot better before it was cut, but that's what I did. And I'm just gonna mix that in with my rice here. So good. Uh, so I had an inter interesting conversation with um, a lady in Alberta today. And apparently a job I applied to like two months ago, um, well they're finally contacting me. 
it all looks good, it all sounds good, um, she seemed to really like me, I mean, we hit it off, we were talking for a good 30 minutes to 45 minutes, uh, it's a camp job, I don't know where in Alberta it is exactly, they're going to call me in a few days for more details, uh, it'd be 20 days on, 10 days off, I'd be in the camp, and then I'd come home. For the first three months, I'll be paying for my own flights. That's the only killer. It's not too. It's not too bad. Like twenty days, I should have a good chunk of money to put away for flights. I ain't gonna be. I'm in camp, so I ain't gonna be spending anything, anyways. Uh, so my plan with that is, I guess, well, me and my brother. If I do get this job, me and my brother, we ain't gonna be able to do any vlogging together for a little bit. It's gonna be hard because this is a permanent position, and it's there for me as long as I want it, if I have the job. And, um, you know, there, yeah, like I said, there's like a three-month uh, probation period. And after that, I'm basically there for ever, <laughs> um, I think. So, if I do get it, I'm going to stick that job out as long as I can. Save up for a house. You know, get myself a computer, because I still don't have a computer, and I need a computer out there if I'm going to be editing and uh, keeping up with all these videos. And uh, I plan to keep vlogging. My day, daily life, my routine's just going to change a little bit. I'm going to be really busy, really tired. Uh, it's 12 to 14 hour days, I'm not really sure. And, um, yeah, so it's going to be hard to be, you know getting videos in and then editing on top of that so what I might be doing is just uh, making small little videos and edit them real quick weekly videos or something like that we'll see how it goes anyways uh, I'll let you know when I find out the rest and could be exciting could be a new little journey new adventure that I'm looking forward to seeing how it all turns out I could use the money so it's getting harder and harder for me to find things to eat. I got some burgers on the go. And they are almost done. I took one for my son though. So I'm only getting two of these bad boys. I feel like I'm eating rice with everything. But that's just the way it is. So what do we got for 12 grams of fat Per burger, so that's 24 grams of fat. 200, no, 320 calories for two burgers. hit 2,692 calories. We have 469 remaining for the day. Uh, what do we have for lunch here? Chicken burger. Which was, uh, I had two chicken burgers, 420 calories, plus the bread, 160 calories for two slices. Steak, roughly, was a five-ouncer, 244 calories. Good protein source. Um, one full cup of dry rice. And then now I just had the two hamburger patties, a cup of dry rice again, and some chocolate milk. Oh, and I had a wagon wheel for a little snack. I don't know what I'm going to eat to hit the rest of that, but I really just have a glass of juice and that will almost take me there. <laughs> 